Welcome back to Take Apart. Today I will show you how to hack any Wi-Fi router with Steam Deck running Kali Linux. Boom, just like this. So this is my Steam Deck, a part of drilled back cover, it is stock. Let's wait for it to boot up and I will switch it to desktop mode. I will show you how to hack this dealing mobile pocket Wi-Fi, but you can use this technique to hack any Wi-Fi routers. PCB Way is the place you need for designing and creating your projects. They have it all and for affordable prices. Get your PCBs, PCBAs, CNC or even 3D printing done and shipped worldwide. Make sure to use my referral link linked in description. Also, you can just grab existing community projects like for example these for Flipper Zero. Once again, PCBWay.com and my referral link is in description below. One thing needed is SD card. I will use this Kingston 32GB SD card the flash and boot Kali Linux. So SD card goes in and now open browser and go to kali.org. Click download, scroll down to live boot and here download recommended. This image has 4.3 GB, it takes a while depending on your internet speed. Once downloaded I'll use Etcher to flash downloaded Kali Linux image onto 32GB SD card, just like so. This process took around 5 minutes. While at flashing, please subscribe and comment below and I will make sure to reply to everyone. Once flashing done we can close all and also shut down the Steam Deck. Now the fun begins. SD card is in, hold minus volume button and press power button. Then release volume button to enter boot manager. Here choose SD slash MMC, Kali Linux live menu appears and choose first option live system. Bit weird as orientation is vertical. Don't worry we will fix that right now. Go to applications, settings and display. Here set rotation to right and hit apply. Also confirm configurations. And voila, freaking Kali Linux is on your Steam Deck. Next thing we will need is keyboard. So go applications, all applications and here search for onboard. This will bring onboard keyboard on screen. Next most important thing is here on my USB flash drive. Commands to unzip and use rockyou.txt word list with like gazillion passwords. You can find all on my website. So I will open flash drive and text file with commands. Also open terminal window and start copy and paste procedure. First to access location, second to unzip rockyou.txt.gz word list, third is to verify that rockyou.txt is unzipped and pops up like so, and last command is to start Wi-Fi program and use the rockyou.txt word list. Here we can see Wi-Fi networks around me. I will focus on this D-Link one first as it has the best signal. So hit Ctrl C to stop scanning. Then hit number one as network I want the hack is first on list. Wi-Fi will start attacks such as WPS, Pixie Dust, cancelled with Ctrl C, then hit C to continue to next attack, which is WPS null pin. So cancel it as well and next this WPS pin attack. Again cancel and this is the one WPA handshake capture. Once Wi-Fi captures handshake, it starts automatically trying each password in rockyou.txt word list. So just sit back and relax, it can take a long time and it's also maxing out my fan speed. I mean if you not subscribed at this stage what are you doing, just hit that button now. And check my other hacking videos, I have full library with hacking content. Flash drive has to go as I need the plugin power to my steam deck. And boom, done. Here is freaking Wi-Fi password cracked.
Alright, let's run these two commands. First with sudo for letting internal Steam Deck's Wi-Fi card be used by Kali Linux. And second the restart network manager. Now I will copy cracked Wi-Fi password and ladies and gentlemen, let me show you how to connect to the Wi-Fi network from this dealing device. Paste password and connect. Done. Let me verify. Here, I am connected to D-Link. There you go fellas, Steam Deck is powerful and versatile device. Thanks for watching and see you next time.